So I realized this test, uh, it won't be anything more than three days. So what I'm gonna do, it's supposed to be really hot here in Southern Michigan at the end of the week. So after we get back from our vacation, we're just gonna put this cooler in the super hot back porch I got. Probably gets 90, 95 in there when it's hot in the summer. We'll put that in the back there and we'll just keep, uh, we'll testing it for days until the ice is gone. Cater Gator really has no ice chest test. Um, I noticed a lot of people saying it didn't work. I noticed some people saying it's a great ice chest, but they didn't test it. They just said it's built good. Yeah, it is built great. I mean, the latches are as good as anyone else's. The, the seal is so good. I mean, once you start putting ice in it, it's locked down. It doesn't, it doesn't open up. But that doesn't say how good its insulation is. So what we'll do is, uh, you know, we'll give it the old test. I know it's not going to be hot up at Mackinac, but like I said, when I come home, keeping all the sodas and there's a lot of water sodas and beers in there i mean this thing is like half full of drinks this isn't the test where they put three drinks in it let's give it a realistic test and see what you can expect from a 65 quart cater gator uh brand cooler like i said they don't come with these wheels though i bought those because they're super kick ass all right bye okay ice test weather outdoors is only like I don't know, in the 60s, but it's supposed to be 70s and 80s later. We're going up to Mackinac for a three-day vacation. Um, I just filled the chest. It's got loads of sodas and waters in here underneath the ice. It's just, it's packed. I put a couple bags, one big bag, one small bag from the store. And then I un unloaded both my refrigerators to give this a nice test. It's got quite a bit of soda. The sodas were pre-chilled. The cooler was pre-chilled for 24 hours with two gallons of frozen water in a jug. I got the little wheels I bought for this cooler that move so much better than factory wheels they put on these things. Um, it's Cater Gator. It's a 65 quart. Um, we're gonna be using this cooler all weekend so it's gonna get a real test, not some baloney where you just leave it out in the, in the sun baking unopened for 24 hours i'll get back with you later when we see how this cooler is holding up sunday morning we'll get up take a look at it okay it's been about 24 hours we've been using this quite a bit in and out of it as you can see lots of ice nothing's really melted much considering how much drinks we have in here here we are and this is sunday morning we put the ice in here on friday morning gotta get this damn pizza out of here still quite a bit of ice we have these blue packs which i which i was using in my uh, backpack quite a bit of ice there is some water down there you know realistically i have a lot of drinks in here there's still a lot of drinks in here you can even drink water and shit like that but looks like it's going to be a uh, at least a couple more days, even with all this crap in it. I'll let you know. Oh, shit, we got here. Again, this is the Cater Gator brand cooler. Quite a bit of ice still, but it's, yeah, it's only Monday. Um, we used this, though. Pretty realistic test. Had a lot of drinks in here. See, we drank most of the sodas, but we didn't really go on a drinking binge. Okay, we're going to skip right ahead to day four. It's Tuesday, Cater Gator Cooler. Um, like I said before, this cooler is heavy as hell when it's full. If you don't buy the one with wheels on it, which wasn't available, I'd definitely suggest you get some wheels. It's Tuesday. Quite a bit of ice. Um, this is stored in a temperature of about 74. All the time it doesn't get any nighttime coolness cater gator doing good okay wednesday morning in the back room it was hot as hell back here yesterday i'm expecting no ice but i was wrong there's still a very good chunk of ice back here but i'm gonna leave it in here all day uh it's gonna be blistering hot again later so, man, this ice chest is really doing good in a real environment without just being set out in the sun and never open. So, hell of a test, Cater. All right, this is 
This will probably be the last day. It's Wednesday. It's late in the afternoon. I've had this cooler in the hot back room again. Let's see what we got. Are you kidding me? Well, you know what? I'm ending this test. There is a little ice left in here, but let's face it. That'll be gone. So, realistically, I, I took all the drinks out of here, too, last night. Realistically, you use this cooler um, outdoors, indoors. It doesn't matter. Um... You're opening it, you've got it half full of drinks, half full of ice. Very realistic test. I think you get five days out of this. That water's still cold. You can still drink from your drinks from it. But, yep, that's the Cater Gator brand cooler. This is their 65 quart. And uh, if you want to get these, I think you just look them up. They come on a, they only sell in one place, uh, Web Restaurant or Websterant. I'm not sure how that is, but. They have 45s, 30s, they have 20s, they have also they even have hundreds. All right, that's a that's a wrap on the Cater Gator um, ice test. Realistic ice test.